Brock Yahawa Brockata, Yahawa Sha, Brockata, Yahawa Brockata, Yahawa Sha, Bahasham, Rakakwadash. Double honors to the apostles, the elders, salutations to you, sincere brothers, teaching and truth and sincerity. A lesson will be entitled Chief Ephraim and the Red Room. Lord, will you are edified? Question Why is Chief Ephraim? Ephraim sitting inside of a red room. What is this red room symbolic for? I'm telling you now, Chief Ephraim is an agent and therefore he does the bidding for Esau. According to Jeremiah 5 and 26, for among my people are found wicked men, all right, my people, Israelites, so-called Negroes, so-called Native Americans, and so-called Hispanics, based on the lineage of our fathers. They lay wait as he that sits snares, and how is Chief Ephraim setting a snare? He's luring men to Go to Chicago this weekend and pull up, okay? For what? To be slaughtered, to be sacrificed, okay? They set a trap. If anybody goes to Chicago, this is a trap. They catch men, and men will be caught. Okay. According to the YouTube handle, Call Me Kenfolk, and his video is entitled Offset Dead and Clone. And this video will be used for fair use purpose only. This video will explain the Red Room. He put it in front of you that this man was gone no longer what is the red room look at look this is the music video where he's sitting here in a red room candles around him pyramid let's look into the red room and what is chief Ephraim sitting inside of a red room. Even if you, you know, red room, like red rum, murder. This is what's going on in this red room. They even have a red room on the dark web. Red rooms are said to be dodgy online spaces within the dark web where illegal activity hides. According to online reports, they're particularly murky areas where sickos can pay to watch live stream videos of bleep, torture, murder, and worse. Users apparently pay thousands or even tens of thousands for access to the dark clips. And even Hollywood shows you, they tell you about this red room. They tell you about this red room. Yeah, I use clone for a lack of better words. I'm glad I'm glad I looked at that and you said that at the at the at the perfect time. I use the word clone for a lack of better words. If if you know the, the difference between a robotoy and a clone, a clone grows at birth. A robotoy is something that you can easily do in a matter of hours. A clone grows a a a a, a, a genuine clone that's playing offset now. But come on, man. I thought niggas knew that already. Like, come on, you can't skip. You can't skip everything else and just get to the gematria because that's going to fuck your whole head up about everything else that's going on. You got to learn everything else first. That's playing offset now. A, 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 a genuine clone grows as a baby. This right here was either a robotoid or a lookalike. That's playing, that's playing offset now. Also, <clears throat> let's just focus on the information 
about the Red Room. But come on, man. I thought niggas knew that already. Like, come on, you can't skip. You can't skip everything else and just get to the gematria because that's going to fuck your whole head up about everything else that's going on. You got to learn everything else first. And then the gematria going to make everything make sense. Y'all ain't you, you ain't never seen the movie the 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 uh the island? You ain't never seen that? Come on, man. They put it right in front of you. NBA young boy in his music video, he's sitting there, he's sitting there getting his body scanned. Come on, man. They showing us this. And you sitting here just you you sitting here just throwing it, throwing it out the window like this can't be a possibility. I'm tripping. But come on, man. Let's move on, man. To the red room, man. How many times they gonna show us the red room? That these rituals is happening inside of this red room. Sacrificing animals, chickens. They cutting off heads, drinking, drinking. You feel me? All that stuff is going on in the red room. Look up spirit cooking by Maria Ambrogovich. I think that's how you say her name. Where she's sitting there, she got blood, piss, urine, semen, all mixed up, and she... And Jay-Z has been affiliated with that woman. Sitting there splatting the walls with it. It's so <laughs> much other stuff going on, dude. The Red Room. This is what's going on in the Red Room. And Hollywood keep on pointing out to you that it's real. How much is your life worth? How many how many red room movies they gonna make? It's the red room. And he's sitting here showing you, Rihanna, every every person that has taken a picture inside of this red room. They have either sacrificed somebody, they're going to sacrifice somebody, or they're going to be the sacrifice. And they're sitting here put and they're sitting there putting it in front of you when they take pictures inside of this red room. Rihanna. Now she wanna call for end to gun violence. All of a sudden, like like niggas wasn't getting killed after her cousin. But all of us now you care about gun violence after your cousin. Like cut the shit. You know what the hell happened. Sitting here in this red room with this damn smirk on her face. Everybody, young thug in the red room. Young thug's not dead yet. Right? He's not dead. But what did I tell you? Everybody that takes a picture in the red room is either going to be sacrificed or they're going to make a sacrifice. Right? Lil' Key, Young Thug's artist, dead at 24 years old. And he took a picture in the red room. The state is now handing out monthly health spending cards by the thousands. All Americans are qualified, but you don't have much time left. Lil Pete, rapper Lil Pete, dead at 21. He took a picture in the red room. You see the shout out to Dwayne McLean TV. You see the pattern. You see the pattern here. Matt Miller, one of his last projects. He took a picture in the red room. Matt Miller, dead at 26 years old. Jay Z, look up the date. Look up the date of when this album came out and look up when his nephew died. This album came out after, right after. This was the most recent album after Jay-Z's nephew died. Killed in a car accident with a car that Jay-Z gave him. So what did you do to that car? What, witchcraft? Remote control? You tell me. And then even in the lyrics where he speaks about his nephew death, he put the fault on him. I wonder why. This is a real thing, this red room. Man, you not you not even paying attention, dude. Where's the proof? Okay, I could I could I could we could do that forever. Where's the proof that people are getting blood sacrificed? We could use this forever. That's the same thing that the sheep say. Where's the proof? Did you not hear me in the beginning? I said this is evidence. Evidence is different than proof. Proof is when you have video surveillance of somebody stealing 
right out the store. Evidence is saying, yeah, I seen him walk out the store at the same time that something came up missing. So that's evidence, but that's not proof. Like I said, it's evidence. You got to learn. You got to learn to look up more shit, man. Like I said, you can tell when people just they learn Gematria first and they don't learn nothing else. It's a whole lot of other shit going on in this world, dude. Well, come on, man. I can't spend my time on just one person. Come on. King Bond, same thing. Red Room. And what happens to him? King Bond shot and killed in Atlanta. Right? Everybody that takes a picture in this Red Room. Here, here you go. Even the Migos taking a picture in the Red Room. And, and, and Offset... Out of all of the other people, Offset is giving you the vow of silence. I wonder why. I wonder why. And he's the one that's doing it. And he's the one sitting here in the red room. And he's the one that's sitting in the red room. Y'all hit that like button, man. Come on, man. Let's talk about how this video foreshadowed the killing and told you about it. Now, the video rare room that is linked to murder, right? The music. Come on, man. Let's talk about how this video foreshadowed the killing and told you about it. Now, the video rare room that is linked to murder, right? The music video is four minutes and 44 seconds long. And that's pretty much it. So why is Chief Ephraim sitting inside of a red room? Who is the sacrifice? What is this symbolic for? John 10 and 11, and this is Yahweh Shah speaking. I am the good shepherd. The good shepherd gives his life for the sheep. And what event support what Yahweh Shah stated? The crucifixion. Him dying for the nation of Israel, beginning with the elect starting with the 144. But he that is an hireling, what? But he that is an hireling and not the shepherd whose own the sheep are not, see the wolf come and leave the sheep and flee, and the wolf catch them and scatter the sheep. Now we know that Esau is the wolf. So, in the case of Ephraim, Chief Ephraim, instructing or requesting people, men, to come to Chicago. Does he see the wolf coming? Will he leave the sheep and flee? And will the wolf catch the sheep and scatter the sheep? Okay, these are questions one must ask if you believe in his so-called doctrine because a harling is nothing but what? A hired hand. Strong's G, 3411, Miss Thotas, Miss Thotas. So in the case of Chief Ephraim, it's my assumption that he is a harling. He's hired by who? Esau, right? He's a servant for Esau. He's a wage worker in a sense of bad for Esau. And this is more than a coincidence 
of him sitting in a red room when you understand the symbolic meaning for red rooms. Okay? Lord will you edify Shalom.